A leaf oh, autograph full size football helmets two box break number two. Nate has the Bears and Browns. Brad's the Pats and Texans. Ryan's the Ravens and Rams. Brandon's the Cowboys and Eagles. Levitic kisses the Lions and Redskins. Nate is the Chargers and Jaguars. Leah's the Niners. Jets, Chiefs and Giants. Jared's the Packers and Panthers. Leah's the Raiders and Saints. Ryan's the Bengals and Falcons. Alex is the Seahawks and Cardinals. Alex is the Broncos and Colts. Michael has the Bucks and Bills. Justin's the Finns and Titans. And McKenzie's the Steelers and the Vikings. All right, uh, just start guessing now. You guys can start guessing. Start guessing. I'm going to cut the uh, joint and I'll let it sit. One guess per person. Jared, only one guess, brother. So are you you going with CMC or Rogers? Only one guess per person. Brennan called Stafford. Yo, they came. That was an insane comeback win today. The Falcons choked again. They they got to get rid of Matt Ryan before before it's uh, too late. Before they can't get anything in return for him. Sam Rogers for both. I got you. I got you. All right. Um, I want to go cut it off right now. Cool. All right. Let's get into it. All right, Justin. Look, guy. I saw yours before I got it, so I'll count Justin's. What happened? Ah, uh, he's old. He's old, man. I know nobody guessed this, so. Well, yeah, they don't help, but. Uh, I mean, he's old. Say, sir. Nah, look. I wish it was Diggs. 
Culpepper, AP, Moss. So, I, I mean, I wish it was one of those guys. But instead, not no disrespect. I mean, he was a great quarterback in his day. Uh, we got Scrambling Fran. Fran Tarkin, Hall of Fame 86. Let's go into the Vikings and McKenzie. Unfortunately, for Antarctic stuff does not hold much value. Nice scrim with Fran. Congrats on that, McKenzie. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad, but it's nothing. It's nothing to drool over. I mean, I, maybe if you're a Vikings fan, it is. I guess that might be like the equivalent of me, you know, like someone pulling Roger Staubach or something. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, I think, I mean, I don't know. I'm actually, I think Roger Staubach was a little bit more value than, than Fran Tarkin. But, all right, so you guys can start guessing for the, for the next helmet. Yeah, it is worth more than the spot. Hey, look at that. I mean, look. It is worth more than the spot. Got a point. Got a point. <laughs> Alright, so this is helmet number two of break number two. This closes out the case. Oh yeah, it, like I said, no disrespect to Frank Tarkin. Frank Tarkin was a great quarterback uh, in his respective era. Um, I mean, he was, he was he's a legend. Uh, the problem, it's you know, it's the problem with a lot of those those older quarterbacks. Their stuff just doesn't hold value. I mean, look at Terry Bradshaw, Frank Tarkenton, um, Joe Theismann. Um, yeah, their stuff just doesn't hold value. Um, so, so from a collector's aspect, it's it's you know what I'm saying they're good pieces. Um, but you know what I'm saying with like, if I bought the box, I wouldn't necessarily be happy with that. Um, you know, because I'm not a Vikings fan. If I was a Vikings fan, I might be happy with it, but I'm not. <laughs> Ray guy. Brennan would be the, the type of person to put Ray guy. Nice sense on it. Yeah, that'd be dope. Maybe a breeze. I think breeze is in here. That'd be sick. Come on, Lester. All right, um, let's go. I'm gonna cut it off here. Let's see who it is. Let's see if anybody guessed it. Oh, man. I don't think anybody guessed this. This is a nice helmet to get right about now. Oh, yeah. No, nobody guessed it. I don't think.
think, right? Rodgers, Juju, Eddie George, Higgins, Theismann, Falk, Lattimore, AK, Michelle, Ray Guy, Tua, Fitzgerald. Nobody guessed this one. This is a look, I'll tell you what. This is the perfect time. If we hit, if we hit this helmet last week, nah, but this is the perfect time to hit this helmet. You know what I'm saying? Like if this came out, because we did do, I think we did two or three cases of these originally. Uh, if we pulled this this out of there. Then uh, it wouldn't be good, but I mean, this is it's a good time to hit this helmet. Uh, we don't have any, what breaks are still open? I don't think there's anything still open at the moment. Uh, we don't have any soccer products. We're probably not going to get any soccer pro soccer products less than, unless they're pre, pre-bought. pre um, Because we, we just, we always get stuck when we have a hard time filling soccer. Not Claypool, not Claypool. Claypool actually had a really bad week this week. He had one target, one reception, and negative two yards. It's not Claypool. Yeah, it's McKenzie again. McKenzie swept. All right, let's go. We got JSA start. How about... Antonio Brown, Antonio Brown, let's go. Just sign with the Buccaneers. Let's go. The clown himself. That's dope. Like I said, it's a, it's a good time to get it. It's definitely a good time to get this helmet. Uh, who knows? Who knows? I mean, he's, he's going into an already electric offense, uh, so... He he um he might be able to to become the the wide receiver that he once was in Tampa with Brady. Look, he played one game with Brady last year and had like eight targets, four catches, and a touchdown. So Brady him uh, Brady has a has a connection with him. Um, Brady likes to throw the ball to him. I think he's gonna be good in Tampa. I think he's gonna be good. Anyways, let's go into the Steelers because it's a Steelers helmet. And McKenzie with the Steelers. There you go, McKenzie. McKenzie probably hates Antonio Brown, but it's still a nice helmet. Yeah, well, yeah, but uh, look, Bruce, I forget the exact quote, but basically Bruce Arians told him, you play with the team, you're a part of the team, or you're off the team. Something like that. So, this is this is his last chance, man. I mean, he knows that if, if he doesn't... Uh, To be look, to be fair, he I think he would have made it with New England, but then the the whole rape accusation came out, um, and I don't know. Then he got like he he got uh, banned from the league and then like suspended eight games. Yeah, he won't play till week nine. He's suspended until week eight. He has an eight-week suspension. 